Hello and welcome to Zach 103 TV and today we will be racing at Atlanta and starting on pole will be Cactus King 84 and uh, this is Atlanta and uh, take a look at uh, our winner of the Jazz 500 German Chick 81 starting in the back for this race. Um, we'll have to move up to the front. You got a lot of good cars starting in the back. Um, pole sitter for the Jazz 500. And in fact, the front row for the Jazz 500 starting in the back. Dropsy, who just came off a rough finish at Daytona, starting in the back as well. Hopefully they can move up front, get some good positioning going, uh, before, uh, too far in this race. So hopefully that goes well. Jason Waymeyer starting second. Third is Dissect. Fourth is Flam. And fifth is Joy Paints. And as you can see, the rest of our top 10, we're going to be going green in a little under a minute. So, um, yeah. And uh, go through some of the cars in the field. Jason Waymeyer. Oh, dang. I think I clicked the wrong thing. And then you can see John McFadden starting sixth. Seventh is Van D. Uh, eighth is Seal. Ninth, Abigail Lane. And tenth will be Mr. Fresh American. And since there will be going uh, green in just a few seconds, I'm going to go ahead and go to back to... I'm going to go to the pace car, actually. And I'm going to... Look from there. Drivers, start your engines! As the uh, command has been given, we're going to see him roll off right about now. As the cars are rolling off, pace car about to go into pit road. I'm going to go to Jason Waymire, uh, camera one space car enters pit road. And there's Jason Waymire. And green flag is in the air here at Atlanta as Cactus King and Cactus Motorsports go into the lead. A little help from a uh, rivaling uh, team, Orbit Racing. They got uh, currently three of their cars in the top five, excluding Drone Chick 81, who won at the Jazz 500. And Cactus Motorsports has won the pole in the first two races of the Cars Link Cup Series. This this race in the Jazz 500. There's Jason Waymar going to go to the top, and we may go three wide for the lead on the start of the race. Three wide, Jason Waymeyer will lead that lap. This three wide racing, Jason Waymeyer will come to the lead. I think that was lap on the first lap, coming to the end of the first lap. Three wide race, and here comes Dissect along with Joy Paints on the bottom. See if they can make any moves. Another fun fact, the highest running forward is Seal in seventh. Dissect along with the help of team owner Flam for Orbit Racing. Enjoy Paints not too far back. Trying to get Jason Waymeyer out of the lead. Lap 3 out of 33 laps. And Dissect going to the bottom. Here it is from a helicopter camera. Some would say the Goodyear blimp. As Jason Waymeyer leads the race, this, every lap you lead is five points, which is a lot. Dissect led that lap. I'm going to try to stay on the same camera here, that way I can track the laps led. And Dissect, uh, 
has the lead now, and it's just one, two drivers up here, Chevy versus Dodge, Jason Waymeyer versus Dysek in the seven. And uh, every lap led, like I said, is five points. As Dysek has the lead, I think we're gonna pan back to some drivers in the back for a little bit here. 89 of Flam versus Cactus King. 86 of Flam, my bad. There's Jazz Racing's uh, John McFadden, team owner for that. He uh, finished 10th last race. I'm gonna get a better finish here. He was a sponsor for the Jazz Farmer and is the co owner of the Cars Lane Cup series. And it looks like Jason Waymeyer trying to keep up with Dysek up there. Oh, and Flam almost turns a 17 around there. Very close as uh, Jason Waymeyer uh, trying uh, with that uh, might be getting a push from Flam to try to take the lead as Cactus King is trying to challenge it as well. Dissect still leading, getting very good points here towards standings. King did lead. I think he led a few laps at the Daytona. And here he goes. Going to try for the slingshot around the seven. As Jason Waymeyer might try to take it three wide. These three right here took it three wide on the first lap. They might do it again. And uh, this is a 33 lap race. It's a long one. As Dysek is just trying to keep these guys back there, lead some laps as uh, Mr. Fresh American in the nine gonna take it three wide with Roach and uh, Seal. You see have Sam Korbadzik up there trying to get some going. We are really getting dicey back there. As Flam is leading laps here at Atlanta. And it's Flam versus Cactus King for second. We may see an even bigger battle here. It's Flam. I think he will keep second for a bit here. His teammates up front. There's a uh, Evett Vandy in the 37 trying to make a move down there. Roach finished well at Daytona. As we have Jason Waymeyer on the top along with John McFadden. And it looks like Flam trying to challenge Dissect for the lead here, not quite getting the run he needs for that. Yeah, he's still trying to do it. Flam versus Dissect coming to finish lap 10. No cautions. Uh, he didn't have any cautions in the Jazz 500 or the uh, this race here at Atlanta, but caution, uh, yellow flags are turned on. So if there is a wreck, we will have a caution. As Flame will take the lead here at Atlanta. I think I, think I wasn't paying attention when he did that. Cactus King still battling, trying to stay up here. Full sitter. Is Dysek getting dicey up there in second with Jason Waymeyer's that lead had already been eaten. Didn't take nothing. And Jason Waymeyer trying to do something. I think Flam's got some good block going here. And he will block his teammate, but will that open the door for Jason Waymeyer? It will, but. The top has shown to be decently well in this race as it does prevail for Flam. 
So Orbit Racing doing pretty good here today as they did last race winning it at the Jazz 500. Might win again today but with a different driver, the team owner. But there's still competition up here. All Orbit Racing on the top. German Chick 81 did start further back. But I think if it uh, would have been up front, would have been very competitive here as we see uh, Jason Waymeyer down on the bottom. Going to try to retake the lead. I don't think he's got what it takes. Nope. Jason Waymeyer still trying to get something to where he can get by these, by these orbit racing cars and then uh, John McFadden as well along with Evett Van D and uh, they're going to go three wide and turn three for second there goes Dysek on the top he's going to challenge his team owner Flam it doesn't going to work yeah make those moves three wide racing here in Atlanta And there's Dysek going to try to get on the top. Here's John McFadden behind the 86 to Flam as Dysek again going to take the lead. And uh, Jason Waymeyer up top trying to make some moves as well. And there's Cactus King, Joy Paints. Highest running forward now is Sam Korbadzik who has driven up into the top 10. And uh, Dysek once again leading the race. Dysek doing an exceptional job here today. As teammate Flam eats that lead right back up. Going to try to go to the bottom here. Has shown not to be successful in trying to take the lead. We'll see how that goes. Jason Waymeyer on the top again and uh, really dicey. Cactus King dives into turn one and it might, get, it might help him off turn two. It looks like it will, but uh, 17's in the way. Is John McFadden going to try to go for the bottom against Flam? There's uh, Sam Kravatz going to make a three wide as well, but he's not going to quite latch on. Going to fall back a bit. There's John McFadden. Going to try to get around Dysek with the help of Joy Paints. Going against her own team to do that. I think Jazz might be able to pull in front of the seven here, and he will. John McFadden. For McFadden Racing leading the race. I don't think he has any teammates in the top five. Is Orbit Racing three wide trying to get back past the 89. Dysek may be successful. He will be successful in that. Dysek back to the lead, but another push from the bottom. It's going to be tight for three wide again. Cactus King. Making some moves against Jason Weimar and Evett Van D. John McFadden falling back again to third as Dysek once again back in the lead. For Orbit Racing. Orbit Racing has done exceptional in this series. It's only race two and already looking for a second win. A drone Chick 81 not getting a good start. Fall back in the pack. Now, I think the most consistent driver in these two races, uh, Joy Paints finished fourth in the Jazz 500. Currently running, well, yeah, fourth. And we crossed the stripe the last time by. As Joy Paints going to make three wide for second. He's going to, I think John McFadden will gain an advantage from that. Not sure. Is uh, Joy Payne's going to fall back? Is uh, Dysek up front? And there's Flam. 
versus John McFadden. Ooh, it's getting tight. Joy Paints versus John McFadden here for third. And uh, we are lap 22 out of 33. So still a little bit of racing left to go here, but the majority of the race is done. Laps led by Dysek. I'm, I'm confident he will lead the most laps for this race. And five points a lap. That is a lot of points for every lap led as Cactus King again trying to get underneath. The 77, our only triple digit car is Flam is going to try to get around the 7 of Dysek again. I don't think it's going to work here. I don't know. As John McFadden again going to try to take advantage of this battle up here. Trying to merge ahead. Not quite going his way. Is Joy Paints going to go up the track there? Um, move up the lane to try to get around John McFadden? Easily will do that. One, two, three for orbit racing. Just one driver that's not up there. And unfortunately, I don't think they're going to get a top five. Number Chick 81, who won the Jazz 500. It's Flam versus Dysek right now, side by side, as we're under 10 to go. Side-by-side -side racing for the lead as Joy Paints is trying to get into the corner fast enough to catch up to these guys. John McFadden getting aggressive, very aggressive. The 86 keeps trying and keeps trying. Has been unsuccessful for the most few laps. As Flam is now to the lead. And Joy Payne's going to try to get underneath Dissect. I think Dissect's going to get a run on the top and get around Flam again. Flam going to block it? No, as Flam will take the lead and. Mm, Yep, Dysek did lead that lap by, uh, well, he didn't lead it by anything, just led it. So, these guys trying to battle for position here. It's really within the top five that's really getting dicey. John McFadden all over by himself in fourth. This orbit racing battling for position here. The laps are winding down. So Flam did lead that lap. Joy Paints, ooh, getting tight there. Everyone is on the lead lap and in pace. Everyone is on the lead lap and in pace. No DNF so far. And in last, I believe, is not a lead. And Yeah, not a good race for drop scene 39th. Gee. Not a good race. As Flame is leading him, putting burn him and putting him down. I think as they would say. And once again, Joy Paints versus John McFadden with Roach and Cactus King. Roach has been crawling his way up there slowly but surely. Here comes Cactus King. Might make a three wide, will not. Is Jisek going to try to get around Flam up top in front? Won't work, I don't think. No, it will work. Uh, Flam, uh, Dysek did lead that lap over uh, Flam. As uh, they are battling for the lead, is Roach up here in fourth? Uh, doing something up here. 
as we were as getting really close to the finish it may come down to dissect and flam as Roach will get around John McFadden Roach in the 66 for Arctic Racing gonna sniff the back of the 86 get right underneath him might be able to get around him here but I don't think he will no and there's Dissec and Flam up there. John McFadden again giving a push. Dissec is in the lead. We're going to the 86 is Roof Cam. Is Roach right there behind the seven as we hit one lap to go here at Atlanta? It's Flam versus Dissec side by side. If Dissec can clear him here, he might get it. He will not. It's going to be side by side to the line, I think, of John McFadden. Flam versus Dissex, side by side. Coming off of turn four. Dice Flam is gonna take the lead and he is going to win here at Atlanta. What a race. And your top 10 are uh, Flam, Dissex, John McFadden, Um, Roach, Cactus King, Gar Salamander, uh, who did finish well last race, along with Joy Paints, Abigail Lane, Evett Van D, and Sam Kurbatsik. Well, that's going to conclude this race. Thank you for watching. We'll see you guys at uh, the next truck, which I believe is Cleveland Airport.